to the Let's Do It Again band and show with the one and only your host, straight out of Washington, D.C., Southeast, Tom Mo. What's up with y'all, man? How y'all feeling out there today? I, mean, I got a little, I don't know, is it a little cold or <clears throat> a little adjusting, something going on with me, man. My voice ain't, ain't the same like it's supposed to be, but anyway. We're going to get started tonight, man. We're going to do some things, man. Talk about some things that's going on, that's coming up, that uh, I'm involved in. First thing I want to do, man, is just, uh, I got to go back a few. I got to go back to, to my last show. Because my last show, I didn't send my shout-outs, man, to um, Vintage Band and Show. that Because we had that show that Saturday, y'all remember, on the 6th. 6th of July, we had that, that show down there at uh, Infuse. And I ain't getting, man, no shout-outs uh, that my last show, man, after that that show. But, man, we had a ball down there, man, Vintage, and let's do it again, man, man. We was down there. We turned that thing up. I mean, like, all the way up, man. We turned up a few notches, man. But we actually going right back down there. Um, <clears throat> I want to say on the 27th, we'll be back down there at the uh, – Infused Bond Grill, man, right there on Allentown Road. Uh, Vintage Band, and Let's Do It Again Band supposed to be there. And the reason I say supposed to be there is because I have another engagement that I need to take care of on that particular night. Not saying that I still won't make it, I don't know. It's, it's in the air right now, so... But that's pretty much what's going to be happening with uh, Infuse Bond Grill, uh, July the 27th. Uh, of course, it starts between 9 and 1. So, you know, hey, if you're interested, come on out and party with us. 
to, uh, this Saturday we're going to be doing a um, a benefit for the homeless downtown. <clears throat> the band ain't gonna play, man, probably around twelve. If I'm not mistaken, I think they said around about 12, man, we're going to kick it off. And we might do a good 45 minutes to an hour or something, man, you know, to show our love, man. This is a part of, of what I do for us, giving back to the community. That, man, you know, when we have those type of events outside for the community, man, I want to be a part of that, man. We don't get no, no accolades for those. We don't get paid or none of that, man, for that. But it's all good because guess what? That's what we should do. Give back to the community, man. Help, help people that are trying to help themselves people that need help, things of that nature. Y'all know where I'm at. But anyway, man, look, y'all already know where we're going with this right here. Bam! Here we go. Geeking for success. Geeking for success. Man, we coming up. For real, we coming up. We coming up, man. We got so much stuff going on. All you need to do is go on Instagram, put in we, the link one, you're going to see the whole layout. You can go on Let's do it again, band, underscore, G4S. You're going to see the whole layout. It's just so much we got going on, man, with this, with the, with the geeking, geeking for success, man. Look, I already told y'all, man, I'm looking to sign some people. If you got the talent, man, you can call me tonight, man, 240-719-2560. And I'm going to plug you in. If you think you're a singer... And you think, man, that you got a, a, a chance to make it? I'm your plug. <clears throat> I'm your plug. You're going to get everything that you're supposed to get, man. I'm talking about shows, uh, airplay, radio time, photo shoots. You're going to get the travel. We all linked in. That's what I'm trying to tell you. We linked in, so hey. Don't feel, be ashamed to call in, man. Once again, 240-719-2560. Now, y'all already know before I start my show, I like to give you a little, you know, inspiration or something that I may have heard. And tonight, <clears throat> what I want to give y'all, man, is that having faith. And the reason I'm saying having faith, man, because, man, I be talking to so many different people. And they be going through some challenges within their life, right? And it's all because they lose, they losing faith. We all know, man, that it's it's rough out here. It's rough out here, man. Even if you got a nine to five, it's rough. Even if you got a little side gig you're doing, it's rough. But you gotta hold on to the faith that wherever you're trying to go, you can make it. You're going to get bumps and bruises. You're going to run into stop signs. But those things are just to make you stronger to keep going forward. I just hear so many people just be saying, that I'm tired. Man, I don't want to keep doing this. I'm looking for things that just, like, pop off. And life just not made like that for whatever you're trying to do or whatever you want to just pop off just like that. Nah, man, you got to put your work in. You got to put your work in. You got to go through the ups and the downs. You got to go through with people trying to tell you that you can't do this or you can't do that. that. That's a part of the game. You go through it, man. You go through it, and guess what? One day you're going to wake up and you're going to be successful in what you was doing. And you're going to be able to look back at those people in those times and say, man, I'm glad I didn't give up, man. And that's my notice for you today, man, who all out there that may be going through a struggle financially, personally, physically. Come on, man. You got to, hey, put your big boots on. Matter of fact, put your boogie shoes on. And let's keep on stepping in the mud, man. Let's keep on walking through the water until we get to that dry land. Because you can't go through a tunnel and it's dark all the way and ain't no light on the other side. It's going to be light on the other side, but you got to go through it. And I'm speaking for personal, too, me, myself. You know what I'm saying? I, I go through some, some struggles and some time where it just seems like it's not working out for me and I, and I may want to just give up. And Nah, man, I ain't giving up on nothing, man. I'm pushing forward. If you don't think I'm going to make it, then that's on you. But me, I know I'm going to make it. Why? Because I know who I believe in. Who I believe in. Me. That's who. 
Has Scarface said, me, that low. <laughs> but yeah, man, y'all take that, man, and, and to keep that in y'all spirit throughout the week to, to understand that, you know, nothing comes overnight, man. Nothing comes overnight. Let's move on. I got to put my glasses on here. I got to put my glasses on here. What's up? What's up with you, OG? Hey. <laughs> I know you're talking about me, bro. What's up with you? But anyway, I have <clears throat> a, a, um, okay, how am I going to put it? Because I don't want to, I, I don't want to put it out there, but I'm going to put it out there. Because my guest, uh, unfortunately, couldn't make it tonight to talk about what I'm going to talk about. But I want to talk about it anyway. Because I want y'all to be on point. The club called Power. Right there off of Blainsburg Road. Right behind the stadium. We great do this joint, man. We great bliss that spot. Far as I know, now don't don't hold me on this, but as far as I know, the talk got it. We going to be down there on August the 16th. Yeah, August the 16th, man. And we're going to be doing it big, man. We're going to be selling tickets. The tickets might be out probably by tomorrow. I'm not sure because, you know, my, my associate, he's working on all that. But once the tickets come out, man, I'm going to let y'all know, man. All y'all do go on Instagram again. Uh, we the link one. Let's do it again, band underscore uh, gigging for success. Because we're going to post all that. Y'all going to be able to call and get these tickets, man. We're going to be selling tables. We're going to be doing comedy. Slim, this thing going to be off the chain, man. I'm trying to tell you. We're going to have, we're gonna have the uh, the DJ. I ain't even reveal his name. We're going to have a, a hot DJ that's going to be there that night, man. You know what I'm saying? This is the kickoff for us. This is the kickoff for Gigging for Success and We The Link and Let's Do It Again Band. It's the kickoff. What I say? August the 16th. So y'all be on the lookout for that, man, because I'm saying, man, hey, this thing will be hot. And if you don't get your tickets, we may miss out. We may miss out. Now, on um, the 27th of July, I was telling y'all that I got an event, man, that uh, I was invited to. Um, I think we're going to go and uh, meet with some man, people that's going to help us move up the ladder. Now, I haven't got no calls about these calendars yet, and I'm trying to figure out why. I need to sell like 100 calendars, man. They ain't number $10. That's $10. That's that six-pack of beer you out there buying every day. Call me up, man. Say you want to get about two or three, four calendars, man, at a time, man. Help support a brother, man. Make this movement, man. Because this is going to help us support the community. It ain't about the $10 going to my pocket. I'm going to dig in my pocket and show y'all some money, but I ain't even got nothing in there, so that's a mistake. <laughs> but I'm just trying to tell you, the $10 ain't going to be going to my pocket, man. It's going to be going towards us like we got a, a, the, book, the book bag drive coming out. We want to be able to go out, man, buy all these book bags so we can just give them to the kids, man, with school grade star back. We got to do that. We got to do a coat drive. When it get cold, man, we got to be able to go get a bunch of coats, man, different sizes for different kids, man. We talking about War 7, War 8, man. We trying to do this, man. But we need the community support. We're going to do our part, but we still need y'all, man. Because, look, y'all ain't always been where you at today. Y'all riding the Mercedes. You got the BMWs. You got the, you know, the, the, the Porsches. You know, you got all the fancy cars, man. And y'all rolling around, man, playing the big, man. Come on, man. You got to get back to the city, man. And how, what's the best way to get back? Geeking for success, because that's what we're working for, this city. Bottom line. Now, look, I'm going to take me a quick break, man. Because like I said, man, I feel like I got a little cold coming on. But I'll be right back in a second, man. Don't go nowhere. Give me a call. 240-719-2560. Check out that Boogie Shoes, man. Check it out.
zone. Let's do it again, band and show with your host, Tom Mo, straight out of Washington, D.C., Southeast, man. What's up with you? We had to take a quick break, man, you know what I mean? Pay some bills, you dig? So, look, I was looking at my little book here, and I want to uh, let y'all know again. I'll try to, you know, this this pen ain't right, bro. You get a chance. Can you give me another one, please? Um, <clears throat> let y'all know again that we're going to be, let's do it again, band, going to be in Kenilworth, August the 3rd, along with Vintage Band, and I think they got another, another band going to be playing that day, too. I'm not, I, I, I can't remember the name, but that's going to be Kenilworth Day, man. That's going to be a fun, fun event. Then we're doing another event. These all outside events I'm giving y'all. Another event outside on Georgia Avenue. Uh, uh, we're going to start at 12 o'clock. The way this is looking, I may got two shows. Because I got one show at 12 o'clock. Mm, excuse me. One show at 12 o'clock. And then I got another show at 7 o'clock. Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah, we got two shows on that day. That's right. Okay. I already told y'all about the power for August the 16th. And then we got another show. On the 24th of August. (laughs) 
Then we back down, um, infused with a, 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 a vintage band and show on the 30th of August. We also will be celebrating some birthdays that night too. So that thing, that thing will be off the chain for real. So you, you gotta catch that. You gotta catch that. I don't have anything for September as of yet. Zero. So if you know somebody have a birthday in September, they're trying to throw a party, and they want a band that's fantastic, grown, and sexy. Tell them to look us up at Let's Do It Again Band at gmail.com. That's let's do it again band at gmail.com and see if we can hook up to make that party happen. Ain't no party if you ain't got let's do it again band in it. That's how I feel. Mm. Y'all see me making a mess over here? That's terrible. I was gonna eight before I came, right? So look. I want to give a shout out to my son and my daughter, Lindsay, for coming and taking me out on July 15th for my birthday. We went down to the wharf, which was awesome, man. It was awesome. You talking about, man, I'm talking about they done rearranged that place down there, man. That place looks so good down there. Because I ain't been there there since they did it. Because I don't really be doing a whole lot of going to little spots like that. You know what I mean? But that joint, I mean, like, I put it on uh, Instagram. And I think I'm, yeah, I put it on Instagram. I don't think I'm putting nothing on Facebook. But y'all need to check that scenery out, man. I'm talking about that scenery is, is marvelous down there. But my kids, man, find it no robbery to come and take me out, man. And we ain't stay out no long time, you know, a couple of hours, man, and, and just enjoy conversation among the among, among ourselves. Um, and I just thank y'all, man, for just, you know, thinking about the old man, man, you know. I ain't as young as I used to be, man, you know what I mean? But just to know that your kids, man, Think about you, you know, because a lot of kids, they don't be thinking about their parents out here nowadays. I'm trying to tell you. I know. I know, man. They so into their own life, doing their own thing, man. They, hey. So I was shocked, but I was most definitely ha happy, and, and I'm grateful, man. And I just, once again, I just want to thank my kids, man, for just thinking about me on that day and coming out. So um, also, I want to send a shout-out to my daughter, Joy. Her birthday was yesterday. We did her, her, uh, her boyfriend and family and friends. You know, they threw her a little surprise uh, party uh, where she live at, which uh, the the view is is awesome. I think I posted that on Instagram yesterday as well. It was awesome. I mean, I ain't stay long, but um, I stayed. You know, just to kind of you know celebrate with her. Uh, TSB Catering Company did the food. So you know that was good off the break. That was wonderful, man. Um, I just want to, man, just, you know, get people to understand some stuff, man, about moving up in the world. We can't get stuck in the same place. Year after year after year, you got to grow. I'm going into a place now where I'm trying to get the band to a place where I can maybe branch off. Branch off and get into some other things that's going to help the band grow. Be able to put them in different places. 
Because we, I don't want us to just be playing right here in the city all the time. I want us to travel. I want to get him some experience in traveling in the music world, not just traveling, because I'm quite sure they travel because they grow and they go places and stuff anyway. But I'm talking about with the music scene, man. You know, be on different stages, different plat uh, platforms. You know, getting to see how that's, the experience and how that's about. I done done that when I was younger, you know, because my mom they and my uncle and them, they had a band. I used to travel with them. So I know the feeling. I know how you can feel with that. Um, my man D Eagle, man, he already got me going different places with him, doing interviews and getting ready for certain things that we got coming up. I'm meeting a lot of good people, you know, that's in the music business, which, you know, I didn't know at first. So the whole process is good for me. Even though I'm getting older, but I'm not to a point where I'm ready to get the wheelchair or the crutches and, and just, you know, nah. I feel like, man, God just molding me into be more solid, be more focused, and more strong into what I'm doing and what I'm seeking and where I'm trying to go. You see this hat? Boogie shoes. I got hats and I got T-shirts that I'm going to be selling. I'm going to be selling them, man. So when you come to those events that I be talking about, when you come, it's going to be a table already there, man, with these items there, man, that I want you all to purchase. They ain't there for show, man. It's for you to support Boogie Shoes, the song, and support Let's Do It Again Band. What you going to do? Every week I'm on, every week I'm asking y'all, man, call in. If you got something you want to talk about, man, the floor is open, man. I don't have no problem communicating and talking to you about something because sometimes I feel like I'm a counselor with some of my friends because they call me with some things, man, and, and you know, we rap and we, we talk about it, but after it's all over, man, they be good. They be good. I be like, why you be calling me with all that? They be like, man, because you always give out good advice because my advice ain't just the regular street advice. My advice is the wisdom and God-seeking advice because I want to lead you in the right direction. I'm going to tell you the truth if you like it or not. I'm, I'm going to speak the truth to you because the truth is what's going to set you free. I can't be your friend if I'm going to just agree with you and knowing you you wrong is two left shoes. That, that's not your friend. That's somebody sucking up to you for whatever reason. And I ain't doing that. I ain't, I ain't cut from that cloth to be sucking up, uh, you know, just to have a friend or just to have somebody to talk to and all that. Nah, that's all right. Because if I got to do all that, you might be worried about your business, man, because I ain't, I ain't living like that. I ain't even come up like that. You know what I'm saying? You got to be a man standing on your own two feet, be a woman standing on your own two feet. When you come in, a young adult, when you come 18, you got to stand on your feet. You got to already know you got to be getting a job. You got to be, look, and you got to be ready to get out the house by 21. You got to be moving. You should be living with your mother at that age. What kind of, what kind of games you playing? For real. Especially if you're having kids. And that go for the men, too. You having kids, man, you got to get your apartment. For you can bring your family in, man. That's your job. You got to do that. But, <clears throat> but tomorrow, oh, is it Saturday or Sunday? They said it's going to be like 100 degrees. Did y'all see how the weather keep changing? Raining and hot, even though it's that, that time of month. Because it rains a lot in July. And August, for real. You know what I'm saying? But I think the weather keeps changing so much, that's why my voice is hoarse. Because I ain't did nothing. <clears throat> I ain't did nothing. I ain't been singing and all that. I ain't did none of that. To be going through this. Oh, I want to send a shout out to my man, Coach, e Coach Eaks Hill, too, man. He been doing he been doing a fantastic job with me, man. He's been working with me, man, on some things, man. And uh the guest I had last week, man, he, he introduced us, man. So, yeah, I just want to take my hat off to Slim, man. I've been knowing him for a long time, and I know I know everything. So y'all can't tell me nothing. Don't try to tell me. I already know. But, man, him good friends, man. He's he just stepping this game up with me. And, uh, and I'm most definitely going to push him in the right direction to get back on his A game as he was once upon a time. Not that he fell all the way off, but I'm just saying, we all take a step back every now and then. Um, who else I need to talk about, man? Who else I need to uh, get some uh, 
some big ups. That's what I call it. Big ups. My family out there in uh, Baltimore, man, that I went and visit, man. Shout out to y'all, man. Appreciate you, uh, 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 Busy B. Appreciate you, man. You know what I mean? Shout out to that New York crew, man. Uh, Mama Kim and them when I went out there. Uh, hollered that there. You know? There's just so many people that's in this circle with uh, Geeking for Success that um, it got it got to work. It got to work for us, man. And I think it will. Uh, a friend of mine that I know, a uh, girlfriend, is, is expecting to have a baby to, sometime tonight. We wish her all the luck, man, and, and that God may cover them both, you know, as... She bring a new life into the world, man. I just want to put that out there, you know. Um, it's just so much that that travels through my mind, man. When I get on these shows, I can't never always like. I try to prepare myself before I get here, and then I be ready. And then sometimes when I get here, man, it just stuff be traveling so fast through my brain. It's some things I be missing, and then when I leave. And I be like, dang, I forgot to say such and such, such and such. You know how that go. But look, we're going to take another break, man. And I'll be right back at you, man. I see my, my lead singer, Nikki, keep calling me. Hopefully I'll get her up here one day, man, for she can say some of the good news of how God done blessed her. But we'll be right back in a few, man. Let me holler at somebody, man, and I'll get back at you. Peace. See you in a minute. Oh, my goodness. Here we go again. Come on. I like to send a special dedication out to all my family and friends. Come on, wow. Let's do it again, bad and show. I said we all got to go. Come on. We're drinking in the morning. We're jumping in the evening time. We're moving all night long. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it again.
my Martin Lawrence voice. <laughs> hey, look, what I'm going to do, man, I'm going to take y'all, man, to another spot right now, man, where we was down at Infuse last weekend with Vintage Band and Show. I want to share, man, this crank with y'all, man. I hope y'all enjoy it. It's live, not memory racks, baby. It's live, not memory racks. Appreciate you. Yes. Special shout out to my man, man Ray. This is what you get, man. Got my you man hang out with this good man, man, man at the spot. Is we ready yet? Huh, man. Let's go. Let's go. Doing this for you, Trail. Quick pause for the calls, man. Uh, having a little difficulties, man, with that thing. That thing, that thing beating so good, man. That thing got the whole machine on block. It don't look like it's smoking. <laughs> Bring it back, baby. <laughs> yeah. Love y'all, man. Appreciate Guess we're gonna take it back one more time, man. Special shout out to my man, man Ray. If you haven't been out to let's do the band we'll warm it up for show. you tonight. Is we ready yet? You gotta get there. Let's go. You gotta get there, man. We're gonna start it one more time, all right? My monitors, please. You listening to the sounds of Let's Do the Ken Band and that show. Come on. We just gonna warm up just a little bit, all right? That's all. Oh, no, we got to go past that part because it stopped every time right there. It stopped every time. Every time we get to that, we, we can't go full past that. Because we, cause, cause that joint right there, man, it's, it's smoking every time it get right there. Don't put It ain't gonna work, babe. You think it's the CD? We probably need to clean that joint. You know how them uh, CD systems is, man. You put a CD in that joint, that joint don't be, you know. Cause I know that's that's new. I shouldn't be scratched up. I, I just got that piece. That's a, that's a new new joint, and I haven't even actually played it. <clears throat> I ain't even actually played it. Love y'all, man. Appreciate you. But we keep going. We keep going back to that Special front. Special shout man. out to my man, man Ray. I don't think that thing gonna, gonna push through. I got my man Donnell gonna warm it up for you tonight. Is we ready yet? Let's go. Y'all can hear how eager I am to get started, right? Please, you 
listening to the sounds of Les Hood again, man, and let's go. Come on. We just gonna warm up just a little bit, all right? Nah, man, that's it, man. We can't do that one, man. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I get a little bit more keyboards in my monitors so I can sing this song. Shoulder. Come on! 
for you. Alright? We're gonna take it right back, back, back. Yeah. song, y'all. We gonna take it back just a little bit, all right?
Listening to the sounds of Les Sudakin band. 